Terry is doing a great job learning how to use the POS app, but he has a few more things to learn. In this course, Terry will learn how to process returns. So what are you two learning about next? Next, Terry needs to learn about returns. Would he be able to help us out? Of course! Returns are simple. Start by selecting the Start a Return button. Notice that the green Pay button at the bottom of the screen changes to a red Refund button. Next, select Search for a Ticket. From here, you can scan the barcode on the customer's receipt or search by customer name or ticket number. Are there any other ways to search for tickets? Good question. The default view is all tickets, but you can also filter by My Tickets or this iPad. After you locate the correct ticket, tap on it and then select the Return button. Select which items to return or select the All Lines option to return the entire ticket. Then select Done. Finally, select the red Refund button and choose the Payment Type. Returns are so easy and intuitive in the POS app. You can search for a ticket easily by barcode, customer name, or ticket number. Now that Terry knows how to complete a return in the POS app, there are just a few more things he needs to know before he is a POS master. In the next course, Terry will learn about other POS functions that will help him succeed as a cashier at Nick's Coffee Room.